So Rick, as weather phenomena around the world, even if it's just simply higher temperatures than ever before, whatever is the phenomenon that's stretching the limits of what might have been models that were comfortably contained within certain parameters, every time there's an unprecedented event that you didn't predict, what is what do you have to do with your models? What, what, what's, what's the next step here? Yeah, that's a, a great question, especially if you kind of extend it and say, how does something like AI or machine learning, artificial intelligence and machine learning fit in here? And these extraordinary events, and I think some of the heat waves we've seen, some of the droughts we've seen are examples. They end up providing an incredible volume of new data and our artificial intelligence applications depend critically on what we call training data. So the data from what has happened in the past being used as training for the models of the future. 